Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for the longest time in ages. It's been approximately uh, three years, seven months, two days, nine hours since I last did a vlog. It before. feels like that. So I am vlogging this sort of, well it's not even a weekend, I'm vlogging the next one too. <laughs> <laughs> like three and a half days because me, my mum and my sister are just going on like a little break to an Airbnb down tasting. So we've got like a family friend down there so we're going to go see them and um, go out for a meal in one of the evenings as well. But we just wanted a little breakaway because obviously we've been in lockdown for so long. Yay! Hello. For oh, everyone who has oh. missed, who has missed Little Sprout, she's back in the video so... Yeah, so we're getting ready. We're going to Ashford first to do some shopping in the designer outlet. So I'll just kind of vlog what I can. And yeah, look at my cute earrings. Look at my warning. Look at my cute earrings. I'm wearing a little peaty oh. pan top. No, I just want to show them that my cute little. Where are you going? Oh, am I not doing my it up little and down? Pan top. Hold on a bit. Let me put me down. There you go. Now you can see the full. Yeah, that's good. So yeah, that's my cute outfit. Wait, 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 wait. Guys, tell me you're five years old without telling me you're five years old. How cute, it and glows then, in the dark. Just like, I've organised all my bag and now I'm ruining it. I'm so hot, guys. Me too. <laughs> I've got a matching purse because I'm five years old, apparently, so. <laughs> <laughs> no, I need some. Josh, just come flying out on me. <laughs> right, sis, can you update the vlog? What? The vlog, oh, update the vlog. finished at Ashford Shopping Centre. Or designer outlet, whatever you want to call it. We didn't buy much, did we? No, we went in a few shops. I didn't buy everything, personally. Oh, no, I did. You bought I some bought, nail polishes. Some nail, two nail polishes. I can't say what I bought because it's a present. I brought one for myself and one for sister. Can't say what I bought because that's a present. No, it isn't. Can you put yourself a top? Oh. Sorry, guys, I didn't update you. I broke a nail. Oh. I'm not flipping a finger. I broke a nail. Need to nail pile it. We're getting Nando's now, so when our food comes, we'll vlog it. It's actually quite nice weather to eat out as well, so we are not, lucky. Not so this is mine and Sprout's meal, and Mum's just drinking Coke for lunch. <laughs> <laughs> as it's coming, so we're going to share some of the garlic bread. Lemon. Right, guys, so we've made it. So I'll show you. This is where we come in. I'll have to show you outside when we leave. That goes upstairs, which I'll show you in a sec. So as you walk in, straight into the living room, which is cute. Oh well. And then if you come over here, it's the first bedroom. So this is where Mama Bear will be sleeping. This is all of our stuff for three nights, guys. Women, eh? So then you walk into this section, and then we have the kitchen to our left. Just like a little galley type kitchen. Dining room, which is very dark and dingy. And then this is where Sprout's gonna stay. <laughs> no, just kidding. Then a little toilet, it's a bit dark, you know? So if we go upstairs, I don't know what's in there. But mum is literally moaning about the whole place because it's a really old building. So it's a bit like dark and dingy. There's not like much natural light. There's no hand wash up there. I thought you told me it had everything. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right, up into the bit where, up into mine and Sprout's quarters. Come up the stairs, Ben will fall. So it's a bit lighter an area up here. So a random chair, random thing. Bathtub is so cool. Sink and toilet. So yeah, the bathroom was really big, which we like. Mum was moaning about the shower because obviously you just have to hold it over you, but I'm looking forward to having baths. Then we come out and this is mine and Sprout's room. So it's a bit more, look, fireplaces everywhere. This is what we're talking about, look, there's little doors. Where I think it's gonna pop out of there during the night. But yeah, so. They're very really cute though. Here I am. So yeah, that's the little tour. So yeah, later I'm gonna cut this damn fringe so it's not gonna be as long. But yeah, so I'm gonna struggle to kind of like find anywhere to shoot and film just because it's quite like compact and like I said, it's not much natural lighting. So I'm hoping me and Sprout can just film up here and I'm gonna probably have to shoot like my pictures up here because there's nowhere else to really shoot them. And we're gonna just settle in a little bit and we're just gonna go to the supermarket and get some food and snacks. Guys, I just realised I forgot to show you outside. So this is our little uh, stairway. I don't want to fall. So it's a cute little spiral staircase. And then we come to another door. 
bloody hell. Look at that. I'm in the freedom. Why are you laughing? <laughs> So yeah, this is the outside, and as you can see, it goes up to like that little inside there. It smells a bit like cavey, don't it? This is our little private terrace. We are back from food shopping. Funny thing happened. So we kind of, well, we didn't kind of. We forgot that it was Sunday, which is Sunday hours here in the UK. So supermarkets close at four. I think most of them close at four, but some are five. Anyway, so we were in the store. It was about three forty-five. Me and Sprout were looking at the DVDs. Mum was like a good few hours, like probably about five, six hours back. And the announcement comes on, they're like, oh, store announcement, the store is about to close in 15 minutes. And we both looked at each other and was like, crap, we need to get mum. Then we turn around, all of a sudden you see my mum come flying out from one of the aisles, bombing down to us, running across to like, hurry up and get food. But yeah, it wasn't too bad in the end. We had like 15 minutes to get a little bit. So we only just picked up like a few snacks, um, water, drinks, all that good stuff. Me and Sprout are going to get a takeaway later, which is Sheesh in Hastings, which is a Turkish restaurant. So we're really excited for that because we love a restaurant called Havet. They have like chicken and rice that we love. Um, so we're just going to try somewhere new. And I think it's, it's pretty much all the same anyway. So me and Sprout just filmed a Gymshark video. So I'm not sure if it's going to go up before or after this one. So definitely check that out. It is funny. So yeah, now we're just going to chill. Just going to watch a bit of TV and we get a drink, have a little snack and then... We'll get dinner in a bit and obviously when we get dinner we'll show you that we're just gonna go collect it and bring it back and eat it here guys look how yummy this looks so we've got chicken and rice you get bread with it and then a salad which here we've got some like onions and then is it in this one there's salad in there and then we've got some weird like dessert thing more rice sprout got some chips Woo! yum yum Good morning guys, so it's the next day, so we're literally just getting ready. I've just taken some photos for the gram. So we're just getting ready. Mum and Sprout are literally just getting ready. I'm kind of ready and just waiting for them. So we're going to pop to the town centre and then to B&M. So I'll vlog what I can and then I'll get Sprout when she's ready. We'll do some OOTDs. I need to get some pictures of Sprout as well because we are slacking on Instagram. We don't really post on it that much. And obviously I'm like kind of the only one that takes photos of her. Yeah, that's about it for the morning. So I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. Right, Sprout is finally ready. Yeah. Looking cash today, aren't we? Yeah. So she's got her cute little love heart top that I made her wear. So that we're both Amazing wearing socks. grey. Grey, so look, grey and red to go with the grey and red That's top. That's a good point. I've and then if we switch, well. boom! So I've got a grey top on today. A little bit thicker to keep me a bit warm because I'm not going to bother wearing a jacket. Fashion over jeans and love heart socks. With holes in them. This is a UK sweet for those who don't know. Did you tell them we're going to get sprouts and donuts? We have twin bones. Oh, guys, la 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 la. Ta da! Because we Matching. are. Matching. We've had these for years. Sisters. Oh my god, guys. Right, right, right. Listen to this. Listen to this. So, this house is so noisy, okay, as it is. Like the floorboards creaking and everything. Sprout wanted to sleep over there in case someone, you know. Comes from that night. above the <laughs> Yeah, so I above. get attacked first. <laughs> anyway, so so in the middle of the night, she gets up not once but twice. <laughs> I'm gonna get my torch out and shine it everywhere. <laughs> Literally, she she gets out of bed and we see this flash of light. And I'm thinking, oh my god, like what's happening? But no, it's just her like flashing around the light like this, or she goes to the bathroom. That is so <laughs> dramatic. It is it unreal. She's literally just like, ah, oh, I'm gonna get it out. I'm gonna wake her up. Shine it around. <laughs> Literally, that's what it was like. She's so annoying, honestly. All right, guys, so we are back. Right, it's 1.39 and we're literally just eating our lunch. I got myself a chicken mayonnaise baguette from Greg's. Little Capri Sun. <laughs> what did you get? Quick. I got a Greg's chicken roll baguette thing as well. And what else? Oh, and I got myself some cheese and onion chicken. Yeah, so. We did a bit of shopping and then we went to B M. So what we're gonna do, we're just gonna eat our lunch and then we're gonna give you guys a little haul because why not show you what we got. We need to try and close anyway, so we'll show you guys what we got and then <laughs> You gonna do it? A... Don't be like right up in my grill. Oh what well, for? Just move, no, just move over there. Yeah. Right. right, so as I said, we're gonna show you everything that we bought today. So starting with mine, got some gold edible spray, some cake boards, blue and brown. So they can be like my drops, my back drops for when I do my cakes. Then in Primark, we love the basic accessories. Got some hair bands. Cute, cute earrings for a pound. I don't know how, is that even focusing? 
yeah, cute earrings for a pound, and then I got clip clips on my fringe for a pound, and then my mummy bought me some nice like seamless stretchy ribbed thongs from H&M. And then for the gym, I needed a new black hoodie to go over everything, so I got a cheap one from Primark for eight pound. Got it in the men's section, 2XL, so it fits oversized. And then I got a little banana set to go with some of my fruit theme that I'm gonna do on Instagram. Let's go bananas. <coughs> got it in a size bananas, large, bananas. and it was five pounds. I had to convince her to buy it. Bargain. Yeah. So that's all I picked up apart from two tops that I'm gonna try on and show you guys. Sprout, are you showing what you got? Oh, okay, I see how it works. You pass me my items, please, soon as I'm sitting down. <coughs> so she did buy a new found oh, a new foundation to try, recommended by me. And she got a little... Is there any point of me being here? A little powder. <laughs> well, some, a couple of box sets. Oh, you need to bring it closer, really, so you just need to do it all for me. Go on, say what you bought. Fear the Walking Dead season one to four. £16. It's bargain. And then we brought... Dexter season one to eight, the complete series, which we're actually going to start watching. Which tonight. was thirty four ninety nine from HMV. So if you want to get it, go buy. That it. Okay, so now we're going to try on our outfits. Oh hello. Oh, isn't that so cute? See, it is. I like it. It's so much better than when you tried it on with the jumper on. Well, obviously. So oh, guys. I want one now, Mum. Mum, I want one. What? Yeah, isn't it cute? That's so me. We need to go back. Oh. That is an 11 out of 10. Mum, I want one. Take a seat, take a seat. So this is from New Look, size 14. Gingham print is super stretchy. You don't even show your back fat. Thanks. Yeah, it's a really nice flowy top. I'm going to try that on. I got oh, it in blue as well, but I'll try that one on as well. Oh, yeah. Aww. Just feels big around this bit. Yeah, but I that's think so pretty. That is... Turn around, let's have a look. That will go nice with um, your blue jeans. Yeah. So as I mentioned, guys, another size 14. Got it in blue. 15.99 from New Look. Here comes Sprout. <laughs> what does it look like? Actually, it's not too bad in 40. It really pulls your boot, the boot to pull it up. Is that out? No, it's a big round of neck. You do need the next size down. That's quite cute. Do I look cutesy? Sure. We look like the yodeling ladies from Sweden. You're a little. <laughs> 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 you it's quite a good look. If you've um, got a food baby, you can just pull your top forward and then. No, I'm not. Oh, look at these puppy boys. What does it look like? It's nice though. What do we think? £7 in the sale from New Look Peeps. No, do you think it's nice? Yeah, yeah. it's the puppy sleeve. Oh, oh, but look how cute it is. It is. Oh, it's really tight. Turn around. Oh, that is so cute. Well, the is eyes not... are fine. Oh, oh, are you sure? Well, look how really <laughs> <laughs> hands in the air. You just stuck it. <laughs> it does look nice. Got it in the H&M sale for ten pounds. Fantasia. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> see, Billy does. Pigs need to see, Mum. Yeah. She goes right up to the camera. Yeah, so I've got putting her see. chest in the camera. Beautiful. Hey, are you? You look a wreck. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed the little mini haul there. Yeah, so we'll do Sprouts makeup and then we're going to go down to the pier front later, get some chips and stuff. So I'll just kind of vlog all of that. We're going to get bit. fish and chips from the fish and chip shop. We're going to get some donuts. We might go to arcade. We might go on a little ride. Bye guys. Bye. In the 1930s seven Disney films, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Disney question. Snow White question. Yeah. Snow White. Snow White. Snow once on holiday, don't I? I've for it. Yeah. Mentally preparing, right? <laughs> Yesterday when I was having a bath, I thought, she's going to be hiding when I come out. Like, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Not this time. You can't be. <laughs> <laughs> you weren't expecting me to be there, though, was you? I was 
wasn't. I'm gonna fall him down the stairs. You were already down the stairs. <laughs> That's not the point. <laughs> Good. When you when you were so feet and face. <laughs> You would have been at the bottom. No, because you're both on feet. Your hair when you move forward. Oh my god, wait, stay there. No, what are you doing? Ah, no. You look like a crazy lady. He's electric. He's on the house. Yeah, hold on. Excuse the lighting, it's extremely bright, but um, our afternoon plans have absolutely failed. What's happened? It's decorating, it's closed. Oh my god. I'm literally just saying how I think it was how it's failed and then look for the next one. Oh boy. But so as I was saying, like this whole thing's just been a fail. So we've come down to the seafront to get like our fish and chips, but we wanted to go like on the rides, go in the amusements place, get some donuts, but literally everything is closed. So when we was driving down, mum was like mum made a joke and was like, Oh, it's, there's a sign there that says all the fish and chip shops are closed, which obviously is a lie. But then we went to the one called the Codfather. They say they're open but obviously he's decorating inside at the moment so they're closed and then the next one along which was a good highly reviewed one was closed and now we're at another one which is open which kind of turned into a bit of a fail but we're just going to get our fish and chips and go home basically so maybe tomorrow we can pop down to the seafront properly i need to check if that other place is open because i thought outdoor stuff was kind of allowed open and i've seen that roller coaster working so and that was on sunday so i'm not sure maybe it's just open on weekends mum and sister came back and said that the other fish shop that we was last at was closing those only doing chips so literally four minutes away from the airbnb there's a fish and chip shop so i've got my sausage and chips and sprout has the same as well here's man here's sprout Woo! good morning guys so i didn't finish off the vlog yesterday we literally just had the fish and chip well not fish and chip well yeah fish and chips sausage and chips and then we watched one episode of dexter and then we went to bed because we was all quite tired so today we are going to Eastbourne, I'm going to drive there and back because I'm insured in my mum's car and I've just done my little photo shoot so, so my hair's looking cute. Just waiting for Sprout to get ready, we need to take some pictures on the outside so I can try and get something for the thumbnail and then we'll do our OOTDs. Right, Sprout give us your OOTD. Top is from Asda, it's like a thin jumper with cutesy sleeves. Then Lulu black leggings. Oh, you've got your Supernatural ones then. Uh. These are old Supernatural oh. ones. It matches, eh? Kind of matches. We love a bit of Supernatural. But my whole outfit is from Fashion Nova. My new little purple snake skin bodysuit. And then ripped jeans again. Same as yesterday, but these are new. The first time I've worn them, so... Right, we need to go take pics. We've made it down to the seafront at Eastbourne. It's nice and sunny and hot. I have bought more stuff in Primark that I didn't need that Sprout made me buy. Say hello to the vlog, mother. <laughs> Are you enjoying this? Sprout's gonna get what? What are we gonna get? Donuts. Yeah, she wants donuts. She's so excited, she finally got her donuts. Oh, like <laughs> so we're gonna sit on the pier and eat them. Sis, what are we rating them? Are they nice? Oh, so you enjoy that over there, Billy Boy? Is it nice? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, can I have one? But, mm. Right, so we're back from Eastbourne. So we did a bit of shopping and then we went down to the seafront and then we kind of just headed back basically. So got myself my roast chicken salad sandwich for lunch but it's like half two so that's pretty late so i'm going to show you guys what i got i didn't buy much but i bought some cute little thumper tea towels for five pounds for my future house because they match the kitchen i love my little lime green it's a bit dark in here so you might not be able to tell oh it comes off quite well actually little crappy top from primarni this was three pound got it in a large and then Sprout bought me some, she bought me some measuring spoons for Christmas. So they're like Mickey hands and they're just like, you know, like quarter teaspoon, half a teaspoon. And then for my mum's birthday, we got some earrings and then look at my new cute Mickey popcorn bowl. Obviously, I'm going to take this when I move out eventually as well. And that was five pounds. And that is literally all I bought, which is good because I didn't want to spend more money. But yeah, so I'm going to I'm going to just quickly eat my lunch and then I'm going to do a bit of like packing 
and then we are going to meet a family friend for dinner and yeah we haven't seen them in like years because the mum is Sprout's godmother and she used to babysit me when we were younger and we used to come down to like Hastings every single year to see them and yeah we haven't seen them in probably like how many years do you reckon Sprout about five or more literally probably like five plus years so it'd be nice to finally catch up and see them so yeah um i'll probably end the vlog out in a bit because i'm not going to vlog too much more i'm not bringing my camera because i'm not going to vlog in front of them and i'm not going to vlog them so yeah we're just going to be packing going to eat pack tidy up chill for a bit go out come back watch the brits so I'll probably end it out when we're back maybe guys the most traumatic experience just happened thanks to her right so let me do a quick story if i can so Sprout had gone out for a walk and it's just me and my mum. We're sitting like here and then we hear the bottom door open because there's two doors if you remember. So we heard the bottom door open and then like a few footsteps and then it sounded like they'd gone back out, closed the door, but then they came back in and within that time, me and mum were like, oh my God, let's hide. So we turned off the TV, we rushed into the bedroom over here and hid behind the door and then they come like up the stairs. So we're thinking Sprout's only been gone 15 minutes. What a pointless walk. Anyways. And then we, mum goes, oh, does she have the key? And then I was like, I don't know. And then we hear someone open, try to open this door. Like the key went in and it sounded like it turned a few times, but it was like this probably like banging noise as well. So me and my mum were panicking thinking like, Sprout wouldn't do that. She would just walk in the door. So they left, went downstairs, like slammed the other door. And then me and my mum came out. We were a bit like shocked. We didn't know what to do. And then we noticed the keys were left on the table down there behind me. So we knew Sprout didn't have the key, so we knew it weren't Sprout. So I've tried to call Sprout, there's no answer. So we thought, let's go outside and then we'll go down and speak to the owners as well, just see if they were coming in. Because obviously during like an Airbnb stay, they don't normally come and interrupt or welcome themselves into the property while you're there. So if you guys can see, let me show you actually, it'll be a bit easier. So on this door, obviously you just go like that to open it and then you can put that up to lock it but there's obviously no key thing. So we've tried to get out, like me and my mum have tried to get out and then it's locked. So then we're panicking thinking, someone's trying to break in or now they've locked us in. And then literally as we were doing that, the Airbnb host called and said that there was a misunderstanding between her and her husband because someone had booked two nights, canceled it. And then we booked the three nights over that. She had it down in her diary, we were there for two nights and left this morning. So then we said, oh, we can't get out. So her husband had to come back up and then in that time Sprout had come back. And obviously, cause we left at 10 a.m. this morning. So checkout time's 10. So they assumed or he assumed or whatever, obviously we had left for the day. But yeah, so that was our little panicky story. <laughs> Sprout has changed her little outfit for tonight. It's your new top, isn't it? I've worn it before. Yeah, but it's new, isn't it? Yeah. And then you can't really see, but put a bit of eye makeup on Sprout. So I'm literally just in the same outfit, but we're heading out now. So I'm not gonna vlog anymore. By the time we come back, we're just gonna chill and then leave early in the morning. So we hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, never a thumbs down. Subscribe if you're not subscribed already. And, and turn on your post notifications. That's a new one, you have to remember. Oh. But yeah, we hope you guys enjoyed and we'll see you in the next one. Bye guys. Bye.